Hi, it's Dr. Holdegay Weinstein. I was asked to review the period panties. A patient asked me today, hey doc, what do you think about these period panties? Now, for those of you who've never heard of these, these are basically underwear that you can wear instead of your tampon or your pad. So you wear this one underwear and it's supposed to absorb all the blood for you throughout the day. They even come in different grades. So it'll tell you that it'll absorb the equivalents of one, two, or three uh, tampons. And then there you go, there you have it, magic. Just put on your underwear and then you're good. Um, so here's what I think about that. Now, the vagina, just so you know, likes to stay in the acidic range. Whereas blood is a very basic substance. And so whenever you're on your period and you have a tampon or a pad on, there's a bit of a shift of the pH that happens in the vagina. Some of you that are very attuned to your bodies have probably noticed that there's a little bit of an odor, maybe a like a fishy odor that you notice right around that time. And that's because of that shift of the, of the pH that happens. When you allow that shift to linger or to happen for a long period of time, um, you're likely to get bacterial vaginosis. Not so good. So uh, whenever you're sitting on a pad for the entire day, for example, or you have the same tampon in and it's kind of soaked with blood, then you're at risk for getting bacterial vaginosis. Unfortunately, when you're wearing the same underwear, the same thing can happen. You're shifting the pH of the vagina. Now, a lot of these underwears will claim that they will wick away uh, all the moisture, uh, but so do pads and tampons. And the truth is there's just gonna be some sweat and some blood that's gonna sit there. You probably won't feel wet, um, but it's there and it's gonna sh do some shifting of the pH of the vagina. So I don't recommend wearing that one underwear as your sole protection against uh, your period, especially if you have a moderate or a heavy flow. However, I do think that this is a great product to use in combination with whatever it is that you're using for your cycles. So um, if you uh, are wearing a pad or a tampon already, or maybe a menstrual cup, um, or one of those um, disposable menstrual discs, go ahead and wear your period panty. It gives you that added reassurance that you're not going to leak, especially if you have important things going on that day. Always, always make sure that you're changing your pad or your tampon frequently throughout the day. In fact, I tell my patients, when it's about 25% saturated, go ahead and change it to prevent that shift from happening and to keep the vagina nice and happy. Always use the least absorbent pad or tampon that you require for your given flow and go ahead and put on a period panty on top of that, why not? That's what I think about the period panty. And if you have comments, questions, go ahead, put them in the comment section. Or if you have a product and you wanna know what this board certified OBGYN thinks about it, go ahead and let me know.